Harrison Hardbody Norris. Harrison Hardbody Norris became infamous when the public found out about his dark secret, and it all ended in a lifetime prison sentence. It all started when local authorities in Georgia noticed something strange going on with Harrison. They found that he was living with several females at his house, and many of them were being held against their will. Georgia authorities brought these shocking rumors to the attention of the FBI, and they decided to take swift action. In August of 2005, the FBI raided both of Harrison's homes in Georgia. They found that the rumors were true, and eight women were being held by Harrison. They detailed stories of mistreatment, abuse, and manipulation. The FBI arrested Harrison in October of 2005 on several counts of trafficking women for indecent acts. Harrison was put behind bars and awaited his trial. When the time for a trial finally came, however, he made a stunning decision. Harrison decided that he would reject an attorney and represent himself in court. This was highly unusual, especially since Harrison didn't have any legal experience. He was legally allowed to do this, though, and the trial went ahead with Harrison acting in his own legal defense. During the trial, things only got worse and worse for Harrison. The women held in his complex shared stories that he did many bad things to them. One woman claimed that Harrison had a series of commandments and that he sold them to people in the local area. Another woman also mentioned that Harrison would manipulate them often and made them pay if they broke any rules around his house. By doing this, Harrison kept all of the women in debt, so they had no choice but to do what he asked. Harrison defended himself against these accusations, claiming that all of the women came voluntarily. He alleged that his house was meant as a training location for up-and-coming wrestlers, and that he helped many of them improve and turn their lives around. Unfortunately for Harrison, the jury didn't buy his version of the events. They rendered a guilty verdict against Harrison. He was sentenced to life in prison in April of 2008 and will be behind bars for the rest of his life.